Welcome back to another episode of Daily Fortnite, your daily podcast about Fortnite. I'm your host, Mikey, a.k.a. Mike Daddy, a.k.a. Magnificent Mikey. And today, we got a new outfit in the item shop and another teaser for Deadpool. All right, so again on social media they posted a picture of this new outfit that's in the item shop that we will take a look at closer when we get to that part uh, but of course with this uh, teaser photo that they put out of the new outfit that came out today uh, they put more Deadpool teasers on it again of course they made it you know, with a crayon drawing, they got the unicorn there. They have Deadpool there. They have a taco. They put a little word bubble uh, by her that says, I love tacos with a Deadpool heart and it says Deadpool was here on it. So again, just more teasers that Deadpool will be coming to the item shop very soon. Uh, so there's that and then uh the other thing i want to let you know about today is metallica the uh, fuel fire fury um interactive event concert mini concert thing is they're going to have an encore so august 2nd at 3 p.m eastern uh through august uh 5th at 3 p.m eastern those will be your encore uh, dates uh, to get in there and experience that uh, either one more time or for the first time if you missed it the first time around. All right, and that's all the news I have for you. Let's take a look at uh, how many people are playing this game today. Battle Royale has 150. 1,000 right now. Zero build has 179,000. Uh, reload has 144,000. And reload zero build, zero build has 50,000. So good healthy numbers tonight. Uh, other stuff. Now this game is a lot of fun. Mini game, box PvP, 50 plus mini games. It's got 3,200 right now, and I'll tell you what, this was so much fun. I played this last night with my uh, sons, Blaine and Dante, and we had a blast. It, it, it really is a lot of fun. It, like it says, you get in there, there is a lot of mini games that are box uh, PvP games, but you... For this one, basically what you do is you, you're you in a room at the beginning of each round and you're voting on, it, it'll give you three random choices for a mini game to play and you're voting on them and I love that it takes like no time at all. You get like five seconds to vote and then whatever has the most votes, uh, you play that mini game out of the three that you uh, had a choice to vote on. And there's all kinds of fun things uh, to play. Like, I only played with them for like 45 minutes or something. Um, so there's no way we played all of them, but there was all kinds of funs, like um, mini games in there. Some of them just being box, P box PvP games, but, you know, they'd have a random rules on some of them like some of them would be you know in slow motion some of them would be low gravity uh, but then there was other mini games too where it's like um don't break the glass like the squid games game where you gotta like cross all the way over to the other side without stepping on the glass that breaks you know um there was um i can't remember what it's called but you know oh uh like a little mini game where walls are coming at you, but there's like, you know, you got to try to, you're standing on a platform and you got to stay on the platform, but there's walls coming at you and, you know, each one of them has its own obstacle 
to get through so that you don't get knocked off the platform. So a lot of fun stuff like that. And there was like a, I remember doing one that was like a, a, a balloon one where you're like stuck in this little room with lava at the bottom. Uh, and you're trying to shoot each other's balloons to get them to fall into the lava. Just a ton of fun, different games in that one. It actually uh, was a lot of fun, it, especially if you're playing with friends or people you know. It made for a really fun time. Okay, so try that one out. Uh, and there's, of course, there's a whole lot more to be discovered in the Discover tab. Let's head on over to Quests and see um, if there's anything new. Well, of course, there's the Curse Sales event still going on. Uh, you know, when I finally got a chance <laughs> to play, I was playing uh, the game I just told you guys about with my with my kids. So I still haven't done any more of these curse sales one, but uh, I get a day off uh, tomorrow, so I'll probably start catching up on those. Um, of course, there's the summer road trip still to do. Do your dailies, the reboots, do your all s sweat summer, uh, story stuff, weeklies, so many available. Um, like I said, all I played yesterday was that creative mode with uh, my sons and I'm level 121 now. So I gained three levels just in that like 45 minutes that I was playing with them. All right, uh, let's head on over to item shop and see what's in the item shop today. All right, so let's see. All of the special offers and bundles are here, of course. The Legos, Metallica, all of the jam tracks, uh, the gear for festival, the Wastelander dummy level up quest pack, more cars, uh, the Pirates of the Caribbean, the Icon outfits are still here, the Adidas. Uh, the icon dances, the summer uh, no, soccer outfits, and then we have the arc outfit for two thousand, the chaos agent outfit for one thousand five hundred, the luminous outfit for one thousand five hundred, the scalerita outfit for one thousand uh, two hundred, the grimy outfit for one thousand five hundred. The uh, Ludwig outfit for 1,500. The Heidi outfit for 1,500. Excordian pickaxe for 500. Headbanger emote for 500. The Lion outfit for 1,500. Master Minotaur outfit for 1,500. The Orin outfit for 1,200. No pick pickaxe for 800. Savor the W emote for 500. Flatliner pickaxe for 800. Airlift glider for 1,200. Field surgeon outfit for 1,500. Triage trooper outfit for 1,500. The mine emote still here for 500. The rift warden stellan outfit for 1,200. Warden's Oath Pickaxe for 500. Rift Warden's Raiment Wrap for 300. Brilliant Striker Outfit for 1,200. Have a Seat Emote for 200. The new outfit and bundle is here. This is called the Streetwear Bat Sassin Bundle. Okay, this has the Blair Outfit. This is the new outfit. Stealthy and subtle with style. So, I don't know where the stealth comes in with this character, but okay. Um, just got on some baggy pants, a baggy coat, a um, little hoodie like shirt underneath it. Uh, and, and that's it. I mean, Pretty neat looking. Uh, this is the Blair outfit. Got a Lego style, of course. Uh, it has the black wrap bat. 
uh, let's see. Oops. Yeah, l a low key ball lobber. It has the black. Oh, and the black wrap bat pickaxe. So it's the the black bling and the pickaxe. It's always nice when they have those things that uh, come together like that. And the burst in bubbles wrap. Um, I do like the color scheme and like style of the the back bling and pickaxe. I, I I like that it's got like the crayon graffiti on it, like we've been seeing with the Deadpool stuff. I think that looks that looks uh, pretty good in game here so this bundle is 1600 that's 500 off the total uh they have the show your style section so a ton of wraps are in there that you can get looks like they range from 300 to 500 each and then there are the fncs bundles that are still here and that looks like everything today. You can get any and all of these items using code Mikey, M-M-M-I-K-I-E, in the item shop. And some of the proceeds will go to help support the show. Okay. And if I'm picking an item of the day today, you know, a, a very often I pick the new outfit that's in the item shop, right? But... I'm not going to do that today because it's it looks good, but it is very basic. So it still doesn't beat out a lot of the other things that are in the item shop for me today. And uh, one that I do like um, is our item of the day, which is the Escalerita outfit. Uh, I like the way it looks. I like the color of it black and like bright glowing blue i like the sockets back bling that it comes with i like the effects on that it's just a good looking outfit so there you go that's your item of the day and that's going to be the episode for today uh make sure you go join the daily fortnite discord and hang out with us follow me over on twitch twitter and youtube Head over to Apple Podcasts, leave a five-star rating and a written review for a shout-out on the show. And don't forget, um, now that I can easily see comments on uh, Spotify, go over to Spotify. Or if you're already listening on Spotify, definitely leave comments. Um, and if you're not already listening on Spotify, head over to Spotify and leave comments uh, on, on the episodes. And, I, and uh, you know I'll respond to them. Um, you know, I'll publish them um, over there on Spotify, uh, as well as, you know, either give you written responses back or, uh, you know, answer some of them or respond to some of them, uh, here on the podcast. All right. So that'll be another way, like I said, to get your voice heard here, uh, on the show. All right. Until next time, have fun, be safe, and don't get lost in the storm. <laughs>